In this video, we are going to solve some SQL problems available on HackerRank. Before that, I will give you a basic idea about HackerRank. So, HackerRank is basically a place where programmers from around the world come together to solve problems related to Python programming, machine learning, data science, etc. And HackerRank encourages the users to solve more problems by awarding them with badges, stars after each problem they solve. So, after you solve one problem, you will get some points which will improve your ranking. If your hackering statistics are good and you feel that they will make your resume stand out, you can put them in your achievement section as well. You can highlight your badges or rank on the leaderboard on your resume. So now you have a basic idea about how HackerRank works. Now you can create an account on HackerRank, log in with it and you know start. If you want to compete with others or you want to prepare for a job, you are a student, fill all the details and open it or you can skip it directly open it now i will not turn the dark mode so now you can go to this sql go to sql and you will find this kind of problems there are many problems we are going to solve only 20 problems related to this weather observation station data set so there are 20 such problems on weather observation data there are the other problems, 20 problems from easy to medium level. After solving each problem, you will get some points. Like after solving this problem, you will get 15 points. After solving this one, you will get 10 points. After solving this one, you will get 30 points. So after each point you score, you will improve your rank. You will get a star after scoring 80 to 90 points. And after scoring more 180 to 300 points, you will get the second star, third star. So this will improve your ranking. This will show cause to the recruiters that you know SQL and you have practiced on SQL. So we will start with our first problem, weather observation station problem one. Open it. Now, as you can see, the problem statement says to query a list of cities and state from the station table. So here's your station table. The station table has five columns, ID, city, state, Latin and long W. Latin is latitude, northern latitude, long W is western longitude. You know latitudes and longitudes from your geography lessons. They define the position of any object or city, right? So try to solve this query by yourself. You can pause this video, try to do it by yourself. And after that, we will solve it together. Now, I believe you must have solved the qu query, but if you have not, we can solve it together. So I will use my SQL here because I want to solve it in my SQL compiler. Now to select city and state from station, I will use select city comma state from station. Now I will run my query. So when I run my query, the hacker rank will give it a test case. If the query passes the test case, we are good, but if it does not pass the test case, uh, make few changes in our query. So as you can see, I have passed the test case. Now I can submit my code. I will submit my code. Now after submit, submitting my code, you can see I, I have successfully submitted my code and now I can move to the next challenge. We have also gained 15 points after solving this question. So let's move to the next question.